What's up, family? What it do? Say what it do. Say what it do. So listen, this episode is a little bit different. Whenever we shoot for the vlog, it's usually early in the day and we have like an entire day ahead of us. No, 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 not today. I've been at work all day. Noemi's been working all day. Booby's been at school all day. We're washed. What typically happens is I'll come home from work and we'll get... You heard that? Hey, what you doing? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, what? What happened? So my aunt bought her these baby shark toys. What you doing? What are you doing? You don't like it. You don't like it? Okay, all right, all right. There are better ways than that. I hate those things. Is your daddy giving you a bath? Nah. What you do with the washcloth? Would you eat it? Nah. Look at those feet. Ooh. I smell it. They stink. You want to smell them? Smell them. Yeah, mm -hmm. Ew, my hair stink. Monkey foot. Let's wash your face, okay? Towel. Hold on. Stay put, stay put, stay put. My daddy gets the paper towel. Guess what color towel I got? How'd you know? Did you see it? You're such a good guesser. trying to convince me that her butt cheeks are red. Come on, get back on the bed. What's this? Um, the bed, the bed. The bed. No, what's this I'm holding? What's this in this bottle? Lotion. Lotion, you sure? Look at the color. Yeah. It is yellow. What's yellow, lotion or shea? Shea butter, good job. Oh, when we had that french fry video go viral, this very nice woman looked at my hands and said, my brother, you are ashy. And I think that you deserve better than that. So she created this uh, hand cream for me that's made out of like all of these essential oils. Don't give me the line. It's, it's a bunch of stuff in here that come from nature. It works really well on my hands, but come to find out, it works really well on her skin too. So I slather her down in this at night and she wakes up feeling all soft. Come on. Come on, naked baby. Let's put on the shea butter. Shea butter, baby. Shea butter, baby. Hey.
Look at this baby foot. <laughs> oh, look at these ribs. <laughs> Come on, let's go get some food, mommy. I'm hungry. Oh. Yeah, yeah, you hit your lip on my shoulder. You okay? Let me see it. Mwah. Better? Okay, we good. We good. It's hot. Hmm? Yeah. Hi, mommy. Here, go to your mama. What I was saying was, we just got home and we're exhausted. <laughs> But that's like every single day. That's our lives. I don't know how many of y'all have two working parents in a household, but it is utter chaos. Like, it's it's ridiculous. You gotta struggle to not take work home. Then by the time you get home, you only got this much time with your children. And by the time you put your kids to bed, you only had this much time with your partner. All to wake up and do it all over again. I don't like it. So I figured that I'll show y'all what our weekday nights look like. And, uh... <laughs> Here you go. You about to see what our kitchen really looks like. I mean, we clean it up at night, but man, oh man. Ooh, child to get to. I'm always so fascinated how these YouTube couples have all these kids and their house is always so clean. <laughs> nah. Not at all. Okay, he's not here. Where is he? Where does your brother live? Brother is home. He's home? Where's where's your brother's home? What's your brother's name? Um Oh. Mm, okay, it's a good name. <laughs> Who told you you had a brother? Um my brother not here. What's she talking about? I don't know. You got something you need to no. tell me? <laughs> no. You got something you need to tell me? But over here you have Noemi enjoying one of her favorite hobbies, watching YouTube vlogs. Who is this? This is P.N. Kane. They're an Australian couple. They do mostly like travel vlogs. I mean, we don't go nowhere, but they're like goals. They travel to so many different places. And like, I just like their setup. It's easy. Their episodes aren't too far. And it just makes me want to visit Australia. And they actually are really cute. Oh, he's stressed out. Take a little bite. Hey, me. Mm-hmm. You like it? Mm -hmm. This is fish. Mm. You like it? Mm -hmm. And then this is what? Nothing cheese. You want to eat now? You want to eat up here or at your table? Um, no, we can't eat on the couch. <laughs> Why don't we eat on the on, on the um, island, okay? <laughs> she wants to eat on the couch. Listen, it's already 7.30. That's what she want to do and that's what she going to eat. I'm with it. I didn't realize the little holes at the top of the pepper thing. The pepper shaker mm -hmm. are huge. I thought they were smaller. And you just like, why are there big holes in the pepper? Who knows, man? Thing? And I gave it to her, and I was like, oh yeah. She's but, eating it. You know she don't like spicy food. But it's it because zucchini is so watery when you cook it. I think mm. most of the pepper is gone. And if y'all are wondering why she has Easy Mac, because um, we make these really like really fancy potato <laughs> gratin oh. things from Wegmans. And she be wasting them, and no. Yeah, no. no. You eat the you eat the cheap food until you have real yeah. people taste buds. And she 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 likes it. I'm not I'm not gonna have her waste my fancy food that tastes really good. Not at all. Shout out to Wegmans. If you're from the D.C. area, you know that Wegmans is everything. This is not an ad, but that supermarket literally has everything I could ever want in my life. These are bomb. You need to try them. Man, when she goes to sleep, mm. baby, name two things better than when Emery go to sleep for the night. One is sex, and um, barbecue at our favorite barbecue spot, D City Smokehouse. Damn, <laughs> she right. That's the wall. Do the wall.
the yeah. truth comes out. I, you've never seen me do that before. You have never seen me do that before. Have you? Baby, when have you ever seen me do that? No, no. And Marie, no. Who taught you how to do that then? Show me the dance again. Yeah, that's what I taught. I ain't even see it. And they not gonna see it either. <laughs> she walking up the stairs backwards because she got a hole in her side. And now the baby doing it too. <laughs> Please be careful. You just learned to walk up the stairs the right way. Thank you. Got my baby out here busting it wide open like that, man. No, you shut up. You shut up. You shut up. I said it low. It's only disrespectful if you say it at a certain octave. All right, y'all, it's 8.04. Baby girl's brushing her teeth. Noemi and I tag team this night routine thing. That's always been the way that we do it. What are they up there doing, man? Y'all okay? Okay. I see. Y'all know I can't stick to a point, and it's even worse right now. What was I talking about before she started popping it? I don't, I don't remember. Ooh, she left a wine down this joint. Don't leave your food and your drink around me because I'm a sample it. And that's what I do. One of the best things about having baby girl on the schedule for so long is that, like, even if she doesn't want to go to bed, like, her body just knows it's time to wind down. And we don't really have to fight her when she's in the room. Can you, um, check to make sure she brushing her teeth? <laughs> yeah. You brushing your teeth, fan fan? Let me see. Let me see how you're doing. Oh, that's pretty good. You're the ones in the back, too. There you go. Gotta get the ones all the way back here. <laughs> you ready? Did daddy kiss some? Give me one. Give me one. Mm. No, wait. Where do we just tell me that? Oh, got him. What are we re the hat? No. No. Can I have it? Look at it before you start volunteering and stuff. Let's, let's read homemade love. She been um, digging Grace for president lately. This isn't a book. She always want to read something that's not, not a book. book. Okay, let's find a book. Ooh, boo boo, look at this one. No. Yeah, it's Grace for president. Uh huh. Mm hmm. You want to read Grace for president? Yes. Hey, look, don't. Pick a long book. I'm just gonna nah, that's what you do. You just read three pages and you go the end. Today was actually the day of Kobe Bryant's funeral. So we didn't really follow our normal routine. I think like everybody in LA, most people in the US and tons of people around the world, like we just really affected and heartbroken by it. And um, you know, myself included, a lot of us don't always process death very well, we find creative ways to move around it. Mine is avoidance. I didn't watch the funeral today. I couldn't, but um, my my heart, my soul, and my spirit was with Kobe and Gigi and their family, man. So I think today what we really wanted to do was just kind of be around each other, be in each other's space, and um, just really enjoy each other while we here. I haven't really had a reminder of my mortality that Shocking in a long time probably ever to be honest with you and that means cuddling up with baby girl on the couch when she eats her dinner That's fine. Oh, that means spending some time and talking to my wife about our vlog and Cleaning up the kitchen so that we got nice sparkly countertops when we wake up in the morning Um, then that's cool, too. So this was pretty short, but thank y'all for spending it with us We're gonna try this again, and maybe we'll get it right next time, but Probably not <laughs> Probably not. I need for you to hit the subscribe button and I also need for you to hit the notification button so that you can know of all our posts 
as soon as they post, stop playing. I'm about to go upstairs and fake watch Netflix with her for 15 minutes before I home. Before I close out, real quick, like who taught my daughter that little dance? Like what was that? You know what? No, not tonight. I'll see y'all next time. Oh,